Oh shit. I dropped it. <laughs> oh no. I, I got it. Everything's fine. Well, the, the flow's closed. <laughs> Clothes folded. Love this woven tray. Oh, it's dirty. Oh no. This feels like a game, doesn't it? Good morning. Welcome back to a new vlog. I'm currently whipping up some breakfast for the hubs um, because I'm gonna make some more of those egg bites from the last like vlog or two ago because those were so good, so easy to heat up, like obsessed. So today is Tuesday, no gym today. I did arm day yesterday and I am, I'm sore. Skull crushers, like this. <laughs> Y'all, it is no joke. Despite Aunt Flo being in town, I'm in a pretty good mood. Okay, so I really wanna get the closet organization done today because you guys know I've kept my closet pretty organized, you know, um, cause it's just like the standard kind of wire that like comes with most walk-in closets, like um, the wire shelves. So I have, it's like an L shape. I have one lined with the um, containers already, but the other side doesn't. So it would make more sense to just have them on both sides so I can like disperse things a little more easily. So I just got some more containers for the other side of the shelving and we'll set that up. I can show you guys how I like organize clothes. Let's get some ice. Good morning, Bruni. We just took a walk and we got to play in the snow. Good morning. You had snow all over your butt. You had snow all over your booty. I just love how much he loves the snow. You wanna make some egg bites? You wanna make some egg bites? And then we need to go out and we need to buy um, some like dog friendly ice melts because they have that. Um, so it's very icy out from the snow yesterday. <laughs> Let's show them the snow, Bruni. It's very, very icy. So yeah, we ended up getting like only about maybe an inch or two, but um, now everything's like kind of frozen over. Like when we were taking our walk, it was very, <laughs> you're so cute. All right, so I am going to make those egg bites from a few vlogs back. I'll link the video down below of like when I made them the first time, um, if you wanna like see that, but I'm gonna listen to a podcast <laughs> while I make them. And we gotta set the ambiance for the day. I love, love this candle from home goods it's like got a really good scent i'm trying to be good about like trimming my wicks because honestly i never did before <laughs> it's something you really should do just because like it was getting too smoky but um yeah this is really good hopefully you guys can find something like this at your home goods or tj maxx um because it's really yummy it's the sensational pine and clementine oh it's like it's just such a nice wintry smell with the snow outside it's just a vibe Oh shit. I dropped it. <laughs> oh no! I, I got it. Everything's fine. So I just had two of those egg bites for breakfast. They were so good. I won't lie, like they are the best when they're fresh. Like if you're gonna make them, definitely make them when you can enjoy them. Um, but I do still like hit them in the microwave for like the next few days. And I microwave them when I need to heat them up from the fridge for about a minute, 45 seconds, a minute something like that oh, but they're so good you can add whatever toppings you want so i am going to go run some errands now i need to go to a few places but the most important thing is the ice melt i don't know actually the sun is out it is kind of looking like it's gonna melt like on its own it's like kind of sunny 
but I still think I should go get the ice melts either way so let's go run a few errands okay you guys so funny enough it's actually like almost 40 degrees and all the ice is melting so we don't need ice melt like literally when I got out I was like oh in the matter of like an hour <laughs> it's melting so that's great we don't need ice melts um let me know if you guys have any recommendations or specific brands that you like for a pet friendly ice melt for the Bruni's little paws Woo, that's bright but i am gonna buzz over to target i have a little return those jeans um and those wide leg like really pretty kind of velvety flowy wide leg pants i don't know i can't form words um both are a little bit too big so i'm gonna return those and i need to grab dryer sheets um oxy clean trying to think what else i don't know but yard just did laundry so we also need to fold and get that done so i think i'm just gonna pop into target and uh grab a few things and return that and then we'll head home and get the closet organized and the flow the, the flows closed <laughs> clothes folded words don't know them wearing my new teddy fresh it's such nice quality jewelry today is um the usual and then this is the Aaron necklace from Miranda Fry and then the fashion Jackson bracelet so cute I love it little dangle I'm at a red light <laughs> You know, we just have to take a poke, see if there's anything new. They've got some new faux plants. I know people are always on the hunt for good faux plants. I get a lot from Hearth and Hand. This is the one I have in our kitchen on the stove. Hood, really pretty. And then Studio McGee. I love Studio McGee. Like, oh, I just, I don't know. The aesthetic is so pretty. It's like kind of like traditional meets modern i don't know there's something really really pretty about it like oh i love her style i love that painting back there that would look really pretty in our living room because the one we have now is very like modern i don't know that one's just a little bit a little bit warmer love this eucalyptus i love these lamps too these are so pretty you guys know we have a lot of a lot of this in our home. That woven mirror is so pretty. I love that. But this, that speaks to me. I do love that. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, like all of this. I love this huge vase. It's such a fun statement. Wow, I wish I had somewhere to put it, but I don't. I love this woven tray. Oh, it's dirty. Oh no. So you guys know I love like rattan. I don't know if I ever say that right, but like they have it as like one of those cool like overhang lamps. That is beautiful. I wanna, I wonder if we have somewhere we could put this. Cause like, honestly, I feel like that would give a lot of warmth to our space. Okay, we're doing good, nothing in the cart. <laughs> but let's see um, if there's any good new Ava and Viv or if it's a monstrosity. Okay, this little like silky cowl neck slip dress is kind of gorge. Ooh, color. Okay, this neon green puffer from a new day. <laughs> Cute. I love that. I love neon green and I love a puffer vest. They actually have like a, a few cute things. I like that they have some color too. Oh, I have these sweats. I really like these wide leg sweats from here. They have a matching top for it too. Cute little vibes for work. Ooh, wait a minute, is this? <gasps> this is cute. It's that same one as the black with the cowl neck, but this fun pattern, I think. Okay, it's Ava and Viv. I'm kind of surprised. That's really cute. Ava and Viv is so hit or miss. Like sometimes they have really cute stuff and sometimes I'm like, what is you doing? Okay, I might grab this for Valentine's Day. This cowl neck, really cute with like some jeans and a cardigan. That's really pretty. I know what you're thinking, Alex, what bra do I wear with this? I personally would probably just throw on some nippy covers or you can wear a strapless bra, but sometimes those like with a cowl neck, they kind of put my boobs out too far and like it gets too bunchy. So like just doing nipple covers, kind of the way to go for me. I have kind of small boobs, but that's what I do. Actually, I'm not gonna get it. Who am I kidding? I like, I like it. I wish it wasn't a tank top though. Cause like, I'm like trying to think what am I gonna wear over it? Then it's just a whole thing. So really cute though, but I'm not gonna get it. They have a ton of clearance, like way more than usual. So I might like just dig around for fun. The 
This is honestly kind of a cool top, like tucked into some jeans with some cool black boots. It's kind of fire. Okay, you guys know I have these track pants. I love them. Oh my gosh, they're on sale for, well, not that great. They were normally 30, now they're 21, but run to Target if you want to get them because they're really cute and they're kind of like elevated track pants. I wear those a lot. Guys, I found them in green <gasps> on clearance. The green is only 15, <laughs> so I'm definitely going to grab them. I have mine in a 1X. They're so cute. I love these. I'm so excited. That's a good find. They have this hot pink puffer vest, 35 down to 24. Really cute, but I'm not going to get it, but it's really cute. They actually have a ton of good clearance right now. I'm really glad I popped in because we love a good clearance. This little faux leather puffer, so cute. Oh, here's this again. Is this one on clearance? So cute. They have a bunch of like bathing suits and stuff for vacation. You guys know I'm going to Florida next month, so I'm tempted to peruse, but I don't know. It's a little too soon. We're not going for over a month, so might come back and look another time. We're doing good though. The only thing in my car is these pants and I'm already second guessing them. Cause like the color, I don't know. I do love them though. Okay, time to get what we actually need. We do also need dish pods. We usually just get Cascade platinum and they work really well. Grabbing this for the living room. I know it's Casa Luna, but I'm gonna put it in the living room because it's so pretty. It is coconut soy wax clarity. It smells really good. And I love the packaging. I have two candles right now, but they're for the kitchen. And we just finished our living room candle. So I'm gonna grab this and that's it. Let's go check out. Success. We did good, y'all. Okay, I want your guys' opinion. So what do you guys think about that painting from Target there instead of this? Um, I don't know, do you think, I mean, this is really nice and simple and it matches everything. I just love that Target painting. It's just like a bit more cozy. But like I have this simple one here, like the plant goes into it, but I like that because it's so simple. I like that it like goes up into it. So I don't know if the one from Target would be just like too much or if we'd have to move that plant. But let me know if you think I should keep this or get the one from Target. But um, I don't know if it would kind of interfere with the artwork we have on the frame TV right now because we love this artwork. <laughs> it's so pretty. Are you playing with all your toys? Sometimes I'll just... What is that? What's going on? But anyway, as you can tell, I'm back home. We did good, didn't go crazy at Target, but I'm gonna whip up some salad for lunch and grill some chicken to go on it. Okay, so I'm actually gonna make enough for me and Yar too. This is our little veggie basket we keep in the fridge. I've got some leftover chicken breast I'm gonna season. This big thing of spring mix. So we've got cucumber. I might throw in a little avocado because this is on its way out carrots, tomato. I think I'm just gonna cut this up and season it with adobo. It's just like my go-to seasoning like for chicken. It's just so good. hours later as you can see I didn't make the bed today because we're gonna wash the sheets I threw my hair up I might even have to put on a t-shirt because we're gonna fold laundry and I don't like feeling bulky when I fold laundry also I forgot to pick our affirmation of the day so let's pick a random one together I believe I can be all I want to be and then I, I usually do this in the morning and then I put it on this little stand so it's standing up for the day. These are the little affirmation cards Lily got me. They're from an epic self. It sets some ambiance <laughs> for folding laundry. This smells so good. This one is from Amazon, Salt and Sea from Sweetwater Decor Candles. I love their candles. All right, Bruno, I hate to break it to you, but we gotta strip the bed. I know, 
You don't want to get off. This feels like a game, doesn't it? Laundry is folded. <laughs> um, Yard just brought these up for me. They've been downstairs. Do these have plastic in them? See how it looks kind of like, like it has like a peely thing? I don't think it does. Okay, anyway. So I have six more. We also added them to Yar's closet. They are just like so life-changing. They're from the container store. I will link them. They have shorter ones like this and then the tall ones that I have. So I have all short ones. So I got some tall ones for this shelf over here. As you can see, things are just like piling up too high. Um, so I think it'll just be way better to have more separation between things. And I also need to go through some of my sweatpants because like the Old Navy ones, they all get really pilled. I love the Old Navy ones, but they all are just a little too short and they're pilling in the thighs. So I don't know. I might donate them. I'm not sure um, because I recently got some really good ones from Adidas, but I don't know. First, let's just get these up here put this stuff in my office, like storage, and kind of go from there. cleaning out my closet I need to try on all my jeans and figure out which ones I need to keep so let's try them all on you guys can help me pick okay so these are Ava and Viv skinny jeans I don't really have a lot of skinny jeans anymore but I guess it's good to have some they're cute they fit nice they feel good so I'm gonna keep these okay these are also Ava and Viv these are size 16 for reference these are straight leg these are so comfy <sighs> these feel like leggings. I'm definitely keeping these and I love the wash. These are Spanx jeans in a 1X. They make my butt look really good, like really snatch you. I love these, but I'm gonna tell you this. If you get these, you cannot wear them sitting down. They're just like a little too diggy inny. But if you're doing something where you're gonna be standing, they look great. So they're kind of a special occasion jean. So these are Good American, the ones that fit multiple sizes. These fit 14 to 18 and they're really comfortable. I forgot how many good pairs of jeans I had. That's why you gotta keep your closet organized. They come up nice and high, super stretchy. I love these. Okay, so I hate these jeans because the rips are way too low. Like they're supposed to be at the knee. It's too bad because otherwise they fit really good. They're from Abercrombie, but like I never wear these because I don't like the rip placement. Let me know if you want a part two. Okay, so much better. <laughs> so much better. I actually did a little TikTok trying on some of my jeans to go through them. So we've got like mom jeans, wide leg, straight leg, skinny, like kind of pants like real pants <laughs> wide leg lounge slash pajama um same for that these are wide leg sweats elevated sweats joggers wide leg sweats i know so many sweats but now all my pants are just way 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 more organized and it was really good to go through my jeans too many hours later okay it is almost 5 30 and i'm gonna start making dinner because i'm making lasagna tonight and it takes a while to cook so these are the pasta noodles i'm using they are made of lentil and brown rice they're no boil these are from whole foods they're really really good they have 14 grams of protein seven grams of fiber really really good so anytime i have like a lot of garbage um, I don't have a lot of garbage, <laughs> but when I do, I opt for either like multigrain or a protein version. So these are really, really good. Made of brown rice and yellow lentil. I love these. Now I'm just going to cook some of this up in a pan. While this is cooking, guys, I'm going to throw in a little bit of garlic paste. I would normally do like fresh garlic, but this is what we got. I need to add that to the grocery list salt and pepper. I'm going to brown this before I add the sauce. Okay, while that's cooking, I'm just doing my ricotta mixture. I have some um, reduced fat or skim, whatever, ricotta, an egg, Parmesan cheese, salt and pepper. 
So we're gonna mix that up. If you haven't bought like a meat masher yet, <laughs> these are from Amazon, I'm gonna link it. It's so helpful to like mash up like ground meats and stuff. I even use it when I'm making like avocado toast or when I mash up anything, <laughs> it's so good. So once this is cooked, I'm gonna like drain the fat out and then add in the pasta sauce. I actually forgot I'm gonna add in a little bit of Italian seasoning to this mixture as well. Okay, I drained out the fat and added in the pasta sauce and I'm just letting it kind of simmer for a little bit just to like kind of let it soak in the meat. And then we're going to assemble. The oven is preheated and yeah, time for lasagna. Okay, you guys, I have changed into my pajamas. It is 6.45. We are gonna go watch some TV and eat dinner and just hang out. So I'm going to wrap up this daily vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I love you so much. I'm sending you guys all my love and good vibes. I just wanted to let you know you are doing amazing. I am proud of you. I love you. You're beautiful and strong and good things are coming your way. So spread some good vibes and I love you so much. I'll see you again very soon. Bye.